What is going on, YouTube? We're there back in the game with another video, man. I'm thinking about dying my head red. Just a lot like a part of red. I like I. Hey, man. Vlogmas day. Oh no, bro. If you're new to the channel, man, make sure you go ahead and smack that like button, hit that subscribe button, because we're on the road to 10K. Let me take these off. We're on the road to 10K, man. So if you're new, smack that like button, hit that subscribe button, turn that post notification on. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram, man. My name is Dior. If you don't know me, if you're new here, my name is Dior, and I'm probably going to be your favorite YouTuber after like the next 25 days, because I'm going to be uploading every single day, maybe two times a day, maybe three times. Shit, if I'm really feeling it, four times, which is going to be crazy, but maybe. But it's this video, first day of vlogmas, man. I'm bringing y'all an apartment tour. Now, I recently moved like a whole like five months ago, and I haven't done this video. It's not fully furnished, and um, yeah, enough yapping, nigga. Let's go, motherfucking, to the goddamn apartment tour. Oh, oh, so I'm doing this solo, though. I don't have nobody hold the camera, so. Somebody was gonna open it, right? I just told you we doing this solo dolo, my nigga. Ah, oh, wow. oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Look, this chill. So look, man. If you don't know, I have a clothing brand, and I get a whole bunch of boxes because I make clothes and they send it in a box. So like this right here, ignore it, bro. I'm not dirty, bro. Really, I got OCD word, but. Yeah, I gotta throw all this in the basement and I live like super high, so it's a lot to go downstairs every day with boxes. So we gonna do that later on, you feel me? But ignore that, bro. I promise you I ain't no dirty ass nigga. But walking into the motherfucking apartment, man, we got a big ass door right where we walk in. This is where we just walked through. You know what I'm saying? We come in, just like this. We get a big ass door, bro. You know what I'm saying? With the little people so I can see whenever one of y'all come over. So when I invite y'all niggas, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna see when y'all come over and let y'all in one by one. I'm like 6'3, y'all. And this is how tall the door is, so probably like six. What's that? Like six, seven? I might have. I might have. That might be so incorrect. Nah, that big. That big. Definitely like six, seven, bro. I know what the fuck I'm talking about. So that's like six, seven. But right when you walk in, man, you get the door. And then, boom, this is the view you get, bro. You know what I'm saying? We got the cool little hallway. We're not finna go over there yet. We're gonna do that at the end. We're gonna go around. But get the cool little door, man. You walk in. As y'all can see, I got LED lights all over right here all over the place basically all over the like apartment y'all gonna see when we you know what i'm saying get more down there you feel me but on the other side man as y'all can see i got a whole bunch of different colors now i got completely different colors of chairs this is brown or or stools i should say this is gray this is brown this is red and this is white and the reason why i did that well i didn't purposely do it basically long story short y'all when i went to go get them they didn't have, well, I posted a video on it. Y'all probably seen it, well, if you're new, you haven't, but if you're old, you've seen it. I posted a video on it, and um, they didn't have all the same colors of the same thing. I really wanted the all red or all gray, but they didn't have it, so I was just like, I'm gonna just make mismatching colors, and I don't know, I kinda like it more, cause as y'all gonna see more of my apartment, I'm really into colors now, like, y'all gonna see, like, nigga, I'm like a color fiend. Everything I have is, like, bright. Like, I gotta have bright red. Y'all see me with the pink on, like, Everything I have on is bright, or everything I have in here is bright. So, y'all gonna see, it's gonna kinda compliment it. But, like I said, walking in, man, you get this cool little hallway, you get the whole stool and stuff like that, so whenever y'all come over, one of y'all can get the chair, and then the other y'all, y'all can just sit on each other's lap, pause, hopefully, and it, it, no, not, not the niggas, the females, yeah, 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 y'all could, you know what I'm saying, like, boom. Over here, we got the cool little counter, man. Now, this counter is filled with a whole bunch of stuff I use on the daily, apart from these. These, like I told you, I'm into fashion and stuff like that. So I got this cool little Tom Ford book. This was actually not bought by me. It was actually given to me by the apartment owner, which is lit. So we got this cool little Tom Ford book. I'll be looking at this, getting a whole bunch of inspiration. Got some super cool stuff in here. Got this cool little Louis Vuitton card that came with my shoes, as y'all can see. You know what I'm saying? And I decided to keep this cause um, that motherfucker wasn't cheap, you feel me? So yeah, I just keep it over here on some like cool decoration, whatever. Over here I got this cool little board and I'm not gonna show y'all what it says, but it's like my schedule and like my goals and stuff like that. I'm probably gonna blur it, but you know what I'm saying? My schedule, my goals and all that. This is my schedule. Y'all can't even see it, it's blurred, so it don't matter. 
Over here, man, I keep my keys and stuff like that. Got a dollar, some coins, I don't know, some change. Randomly keep it in here. I keep my car keys right here. So yeah, or I usually keep it over here on this cool little cause like looking thing. I usually keep it right here, but my keys are too heavy. So sometimes it falls. So yeah, got this cool little cause. Uh, cool little notebook, man. I'm like super big into business and planning and stuff like that. So I really write everything down. Like literally, so got that apartment key card over here, man. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. Y'all gonna see I have like a whole like gaming setup, PC setup, and I don't use it at all, bro. Like no cap, my MacBook is like my best friend. Like all the videos y'all see ever seen came from this goddamn hard drive right here and this little MacBook right here, man. I don't even know if this like which MacBook is. This? Is this the new one? I think this is the new one. This is this the new one? I think this is one of the new ones because it got the little screen right here. But this MacBook save. Lies, bro. I absolutely love this MacBook, bro. Everything I do, this MacBook. This video y'all watching is gonna be edited on this MacBook, man. Got a whole bunch of SD cards as y'all can see. This is my SD card patch or pouch, whatever. I keep all of them in here. Over here, man, I just got this in the mail like three days ago because I decided to change my um little thing. What is it called? What is this shit called? What is it called, y'all? Damn! Brain fart. But y'all know what this car, man. I decided to change it because I actually finna be getting a second car real soon. Make sure y'all go ahead and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be getting a second car real soon. And I want a custom place. That's what it's called. I want a custom place. This one got my Instagram or like my main name, DR. And my other one's gonna say dr for l Cause y'all know it's big dr for l Also, if you knew, we rep dr for l over here. So I'm gonna get a second one. And the reason why this is not on my car yet is cause I don't have my car right now. And y'all gonna see also in the next few videos. Well, I don't have my car. Whole bunch of shit is just in the future. So y'all gonna see super cool. But moving on over here, man, I got this lighter. No, I don't smoke. This is only for candles. You know what I'm saying? I don't do none of that smoking. Put a little candle right here on, what did you say, say? Warm leather, amber, I don't know. I recommend though, highly recommend. But boom, over here, TV remote. Over here, <laughs> what a lot of y'all niggas need, man. I don't go nowhere without one of these right here. A lot of y'all niggas need this. Stop walking around with your stinking breath. And then we got the LED light remote for the LED lights. So y'all, that is it for this little section. As y'all can see right here, like I said, I edit everything right here. I really be sitting, all, all of my days, you like 20, bro, like half of my days is sat on this table right here, just brainstorming, or this counter right here, brainstorming, spinning around like these, thinking of new ideas and stuff like that, just, just like this, every day, just boom. Boom, editing, writing. That's why I really have everything right here in life. I did have the candles, got the mints, got everything just right here. This is where I spent half of my days. Even though I got a whole PC setup that I'm gonna show y'all, I just like sitting up here looking at the view. You know what I'm saying? I'm right in the kitchen, right next to the door. If anybody try to come in, you know what I'm saying? Half of my days spent right here, bro. So yeah, this is like whatever you wanna call it. It's like what you see in the entrance. So I don't, I don't know. This not, it's not no damn kitchen. I don't know what they. Yeah, they go on to the next. Boom, bro, after you walk past all this, man, we gonna start right here in the kitchen. We gonna go, we gonna go in the kitchen, man. So boom, this right here is my kitchen, y'all. Now, a lot of y'all probably don't know this, bro, but me, I cook. I know a lot of young people don't really cook. A lot of people just get food out, whatever, whatever. I do get food out sometimes, and I'm not gonna lie, it's more convenient to get food out, basically, for, for what I do because I'm always on the go, always hustling and stuff like that. But when I do have time, I dance, sit down, and I cook. Now, another thing is I'm vegan, y'all. I'm like fully plant-based. So, yeah, just some new shit about me. I'm fully plant-based. So, the way I cook is a little different. Y'all gonna see during vlogs, I'm gonna be doing a couple of meals and stuff like that. I'm super big into health. So, yeah, anyways, this is my kitchen, man. Not really much to say, bro. Nothing on the damn thing, you feel me? Uh, I had a couple knife right there, but somebody in one of my videos told me it's not smart to put knives right here, because if somebody walk in, they gonna look for a knife to battle. Even though me, I got the money. How many knives was in here, bro? Like what, 12, bro? It was like 12 knives in here. And he was right, bro. Somebody said in my comments, bro, if somebody walk in, you're done. You got a whole bunch of knife, especially if it's two of them, they finna have a stab party. So I was like, bro, you know what? You was motherfucking right, bro. So end up taking all the knives and I put it in my dishwasher right here, man. I'm pretty sure this is on, so I'm not gonna turn it on here. Yeah, this shit's on. So I'm not gonna open it, but yeah, it's washing some dishes. Got a whole bunch of dishes in there, whatever, whoop, whoop, bang, bang. Over here, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> dishwash, not dishwasher, sink, wash, hands, dawn, Kuana, yeah, y'all really don't care about that, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, um, what else, what else? You're gonna have to do your own research. You're not supposed to use microwaves, y'all. 
they're not supposed to use microwaves because we're not supposed to use we're not supposed to be eating out of radiation but i'm not gonna preach on that that's something that you gotta look up don't kill the messenger kill him no don't listen to the messenger listen to the message <laughs> yeah but boom coming over here man ignore all this this is like christmas list for my family whatever but um over here right here i got some organic apples more everything i eat is completely organic got some organic apples oh snap don't look at that yeah, I got some organic apples, man. Over here, we got some key lime, and I got some tea right here. So, boom, this is like my kitchen right here, bro. Not much to say about it. Not gonna lie, again, it's literally just the kitchen. Nothing too crazy, man. I uh, got a fridge right there. I forgot to show y'all. Let me show y'all. Got a fridge right there, man. Y'all ain't even see it, but I got a fridge right here. Over here, we got the cool little seasonings and motherfucker, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling y'all, your boy really be cooking in the junk. You feel me? Like everything organic, too. You feel me? Like, we don't play none of that, bro. Got some. Tea in motherfucker, man. I was kind of uh, sick a few, like, weeks ago or a few days ago. So, got some tea. Everything organic, man. Pink salt. You feel me? Like, hey, we don't play none of that, bro. You know what I'm saying? We don't play none of that. So, cool. So down over here, man, I really want to show y'all this for some reason, but um, so let me show y'all what I got in here. I got a whole bunch of like, like I tell y'all, but my channel, like this vlog channel, I'm just getting started being consistent on here. Why am I so low, bro? Like I'm a little too tall for that, but this channel, like I said, it's gonna have a lot to do with health and stuff like that. And just, it's, it, it's really just me being myself, so I want to show y'all this, what I got in here. But I got a whole bunch of herbs, you feel me? Shout out to Von Two Cut, man. Go crazy with the herbs, you feel me? Or yeah, the herbs, the supplements or whatever. You know what I'm saying? This is for my man, you know what I'm saying? For my man who need more energy. If you kind of out of your goddamn masculine and you be feeling lazy and weak, go get you some of this, man. It's called uh, Two Cut Testosterone. It go crazy. You feel me? I'm pretty sure you drop like a detox. So if any of y'all want to detox your body and stuff like that, go get that too. Got some ashwagandha. If y'all don't know about ashwagandha, really good for mental health and stuff like that. You feel me? Levels out stress, you feel me? I do business, so sometimes I be a little stressed out. And then we got some macro. Macro is really good for like just my niggas who work out and stuff like that. You feel me? Get you good proteins, good gains. And then we got some cool little organic beef powder. This is good for your blood. You know what I'm saying? Getting that blood flow going and whoop de whoop. And then yeah, I just wanted to show y'all that because that's just a part of me. Um, I just felt like I should show y'all. I don't know. Like. Alright y'all, so coming on to the next section, which is the living room. I feel like this is probably gonna be everybody's favorite. As y'all can see, bro, your boy, like I said, love colors. It's fully colored out, bro. Just a whole bunch of colors. We got orange, we got yellow, brown, blue, pink, red, a whole bunch of red. If y'all don't know, red is like my red is like my <laughs> I did twist my leg. Red is like my second favorite color. So you're gonna see a whole bunch of red in my crib and a whole bunch of just red stuff, like bold red, you feel me? It's crazy because I used to dead dream of having a living room like this and I don't know how the hell this happened, but it happened with hard work. So coming over here, man, we got this beautiful couch right here. A lot of people ask me about this couch where I got it. You can actually get this couch on Amazon. Ah, that's it. You can get this couch on Amazon, y'all. It's a very comfortable couch. The only thing I would say is, it's not that big. Like, it's not a huge couch. Like, it's not like one of those huge couches. And it's kind of low to the floor, y'all. I'm pretty tall. And as y'all can see, my knees is like, you know what I'm saying? But it does the job, bro. I don't need nothing too big. I'm the only one in here, you know what I'm saying? So it's not like me laying down here. I'm gonna say, just like me watching TV. Cap, I don't watch TV. I can't even tell the last time I watched TV. I probably should start watching TV. Damn. I should definitely start watching TV. Yeah, but you know what I'm saying? Got this cool little couch, man. As y'all can see, we got a whole bunch of pillows, like a whole bunch of pillows with the couch. Got this eight ball pillow. The reason why I got this eight ball pillow is because this is like my angel number, y'all. Like, I'm not, well, I'm lying. I'm into angel numbers, y'all. Like, I, like, you gotta be real, bro. You gotta see the secret. Need. Nothing is a sick, nothing is, what's it called? Nothing is a, Coincidence, nothing's a coincidence, man. So I always, always see eight, bro. So I dead got an eight, eight ball. Cause like that's dead just my number. Like every time I see eight, something good happens. Like I don't know what it is. So got an eight ball right here. Got this cool little bunny looking thing. Um, I don't know what it is. I just got it because it looks cool. Got the cool little Americani. You know, so I feel like every dude, every young dude who got an apartment or a high rise got Americani, bro. Like it's just a must. Either you got a Marikami or you got like a big pillow or what else you got if you're young. That's really it. 
Yeah. But I feel like everybody got it, bro. So got this cool little Americana. I love this color. If y'all don't know, purple is my favorite color. Purple, red is my favorite color, and you know, we got purple and red. Got it right there. You feel me? And then I got this cool little Pikachu red. Why? But I think it's just the color of Pikachu that I like. I don't know. Like if Pikachu was an actual pet, I could go get on everything. I would have him. And don't say it's a chipmunk, cause I'm not getting that. But if it was like this big and he was yellow, but I would dad go get a Pikachu, bro. That's here. I just love Pikachu. I'm gonna, I just love Pikachu. Bro. I dad love Pikachu. So coming on over here, man. I got this cool. Baby Mellow table, man. Y'all seen it in one of these videos. I dropped the video. Well, I went to go get this uh, little table, whatever. I love this table. Or it was on my main channel. I went to go get this table. I love this table, bro. Like, this was the best cop ever. And it was for the low. Shout out to the girl who made this. I don't remember her Instagram, but she went crazy, bro. Like, I didn't want to get the standard glass t coffee table that everybody. I did not want that, bro. I didn't want it. Like, I live next to a key. I could have just went and got it. I just didn't want to. And I just happened to find somebody who sold this table in. Shout out to her, but she did her thing with this table. It's like one of those, like, I don't know, liquid table. Ah, oh, yeah, y'all get the point. Going on down, man, we got this cool little rug. The apartment is filled with a whole bunch of rug. As y'all can see, we got this Vivian Westwood, and then we also have this chair bomb right here, and as well as that. Now, this one I got at Ikea. I'm pretty sure you can go to Ikea and get it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm pretty sure I've seen a whole bunch of people with this exact rug. Coming on over here, man, like I said, I am a clothing brand owner, y'all. I do sell clothes. I am a business person, a business person. A business person, Dior. You are a business person? I am a business owner. So I do constantly have packages and stuff like that right here. And I kind of hit it in this corner, right? Because there's nothing here. So yeah, these are all hoodies. If y'all actually want to go cop, <laughs> quick little promo, quick little plug, quick, quick little plug. As y'all can see, I got the cool little hoodie off of my ladies who are watching this. If you want to go cop the pink one, oh my man, I love pink. As y'all can see, I'm wearing pink. You got this cool little super rich kid hoodie right here, man. Turn around, look at the back, you feel me? Super good quality, crop, you know what I'm saying, for the ladies and, and the man, you know what I'm saying, fit true to size, kind of, well, not really, it fits oversized, so go down one size if you want to cop, and um, yeah, I'm pretty sure there's going to be stuff on the website right now, and it's going to be one to three days shipping, so if you want that, go in the description down below, click the link, and you're going to see, and go shop, you know what I'm saying? So on to the next section of the crib, man, we got the TV, TV stand, and my beautiful, beautiful friend, in denial, man. Now, this is my plant, y'all. Also, y'all, this is why I actually had this bottle right here. This is my plant bottle filled with spring water. In denial, man, she get whatever she wants. She get all the water in the world. So I be spraying her with water like every two days or something like that. I'm just getting started with plants, y'all, and learning how to take care of them. I have another one over there that y'all gonna see, but I'm really just getting started to learn how to take care of them. This is actually a money tree, which is also called something paradise. Correct me for anybody who knows about plants. Uh, yeah, I just love the way it looks, so I got it. It's a beautiful plant. Actually, the reason why I got this plant, quick little story time, story time. So for any of y'all wondering how I got this plant, it's because long story short, I was at Ikea looking for a plant and I didn't know what kind of plant to get. And this random lady come up to me and she just picked me out of like, it was like a whole bunch of people and she walks to me like, skip past a couple people walked to me. She's like, hey, I just find you interesting. Which plant do you think I should pick? This one or this one? It was like the same exact plant, but it was like, one was a little older and one was a little younger. And she was just like, I want you to pick. And I'm like, go with whatever your heart desires. And she's like, no, I want you to pick. And I was just like, that's weird as fuck. And then she ended up saying it was a money tree. And it clicked in my head, like, bro, back like two years ago, I always wanted a money tree, but I never just got it. Like, cause I wanted my own spot to do that. So I finally got my own spot. And then she was like, yeah, because it's a money tree. And I was like, oh, that's a money tree? And she's like, yeah, she's like, you should get one. I was like, nigga, I was about to get one after you just said that guy there. So, end up getting a money tree, and that's how um, I got my dog in the night. Also, I didn't do this. This was like this, because the, the branch was already broken when I got it. And I tried to heal it. I guess I didn't do a good job. Oh it was already broke, I promise it was already broke. It just came off all the way. Bro, damn. Let's go to the next. All right. So boom, on to the next, man. Like I said, we got the TV stand, the actual TV. I don't know how big this TV is. Funny enough, I think, I didn't get scammed, but I just didn't know. This TV was actually supposed to be bigger than it was. I just picked the wrong size because I thought it was going to be bigger, but it actually wasn't bigger. So we got a cool little TV right here, man. I think it's like probably like 70 inch, 65. I don't know. I don't even watch the TV, but got a whole bunch of cool stuff on here. You know what I'm saying? I got this cool little lamp that flashes up. As y'all can see, let me turn all the lights on so y'all can see. 
so boom. It got this little ring, whatever. It's like a lamp light, light. I don't know what it's called for real, but I think we might actually keep it like this so y'all can actually see the ambient lighting. But yeah, I got this cool little lava lamp. That's what it's called, right? A lava lamp? I don't know. Maybe it's called a lava lamp. I don't know. I don't remember. I guess it's called a lava lamp. I don't know what it's called exactly, but we're just gonna call it a lava lamp. But got that, man. Down here, we also got this cool little hand. Just cool decoration, nothing like special. It's like this weird hand that I got. Um, over here, I got this cool little Pikachu thing. I told y'all I literally love Pikachu, bro. Like, I don't know what it is. I just love Pikachu. I have yet to build this. I'm gonna probably get my little cousins to build this with me because I'm not doing this. Well, I do by myself, bro. Cool little Pikachu thing. I wish it was yellow, but I'll do it. It's great. I'm gonna build it. I might build it like for Vlogmas in one of these videos. Y'all let me know if y'all wanna see that. We could build it and then talk. I don't know. That'd be pretty cool in my opinion. That's just but yeah, cool. Got this table, TV, like I said, TV stand. Um, I actually got this like a long time ago, even when I was living with my parents, I had this. And I was just like, when I moved, I just kept it because it fits perfectly, bro. You know what I'm saying? Over here, we got this cool little Goku. I am into anime, y'all. I fuck with anime. Got Goku right here. You know what I'm saying? Um, got the Black Panther figure back there. Yeah, also, we have some LED lights behind the table or whatever. And yeah, that's pretty cool. Nothing crazy over here. Down here, we got some books. I am into books, y'all. I'm gonna show y'all a couple of my book collection. You know what I'm saying? Over here, we got The Richest Man, the richest man of Bab... Damn, The Richest Man of Babylon. Cool book right here, man. But um, yeah, I haven't finished it. We got the science of the science of self realization. Damn, the science of self realization. This is crazy how I got this book, bro. This book was given to me, bro. I kid y'all not. I feel like a lot of people come up to me and just give me things. I swear on everything. That book was given to me. So long story short, I was at the airport picking up my cousin's friend. We was at the airport and some random dude, same thing, walks up to me, tapped to me. He's just like. I think you should have this book. It was just something about the connection that I genuinely fucked with. So I gave him fifty dollars, and then he ended up giving me like six different books, which was crazy. But it's crazy how the hell I got that book. I just thought about that. I forgot how I got that book too now. But yeah, got this cool little self-realization book, man. This is I haven't read this book yet, but I'm pretty sure it's all about like I don't know, like just the self-discovery, you know, finding yourself, all that stuff, which I'm really into. I haven't gotten to that yet because I like some other books right now. But I'm gonna get into it when I got the time. Now over here, I could get canceled. I could I could get canceled for this on the internet now. So I ain't gonna talk too much. But this is really about like the insides of the government and like laws that people don't really know about. Like y'all know like codes, like laws, stuff like that. Like going to court, maybe there's certain laws to bypass that. So this is what this book talk about. Like lawyers really be reading this book. I haven't read it yet because um the saying in this book is fucking disgusting. I don't even want to read it because it's just. But I don't like it. I don't like it. I, I'm gonna read it soon, but I don't like it. But over here we got one day in my mind. What is it? One day in my soul just open. I did read this book. I kind of liked it. It wasn't nothing too too crazy. Um, as y'all can see, all my books is about like soul searching and finding yourself and just deeper, like just deeper. Like I just like deep things. I don't like surface level things. Like, I'm not into that. I like intellect, intellectual, like divine consciousness y'all get, get what i'm saying so boom man once again another thing that we got here is a playstation controller ps ps5 controller now i don't even play this i don't play that shit at all it just sits there bro it's been here forever like the playstation 5 is back here i don't even play it it just sits there i guess it's really decoration now maybe if i got some friends over or some people over or you know what i'm saying whenever y'all come over we can hop on the game outside give y'all a cool little 30 piece of 2k um and then y'all go to sleep you know? So boom, man, next thing, one of my favorite items, like I think this might actually be my favorite item, is this cool ass couch, bro. Ah, now this couch is like super comfortable. Red is red really like slick bean in purple right now. Like purple, red is my favorite color, but like red is like, we got this cool little couch, man. I'm not gonna lie, usually in the risings when I wake up, I either sit over here or over there, you know what I'm saying? And I just kind of like take in the rise and take in everything. Usually I'm turned the other way looking like, like the city or I sit over there, like I say, and I just like sit here and just kind of like get myself ready for the day. I usually like fill myself up with positive thoughts, you know. Um, I'm big into meditating and doing yoga and stuff like that. So early rising, which I'm gonna give y'all a routine on my uh, rising routine or whatever y'all want to call it or morning routine, whatever you want to call it. But I'm gonna give y'all a rising, nah, I'm not saying morning routine. Rising routine, I'm gonna give y'all a um, video on that. 
the routine or whatever on how I do it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you should come over here. Uh, I love this seat right here. I just sit over here, looking that direction, and I meditate, I talk to myself, I affirm to myself, I just tell myself it's gonna be an amazing, great day, and I run it up. Sometimes I scream too. I'm like, it's gonna be a motherfucker? Yeah, I'll be on that. My neighbors probably don't follow you, but. Now, on to the next section, man. I probably should turn this light up, right? On to the next section of the crib, man. One, I think this is sleep my favorite part. Like, this day, like, dude, without this, I don't think the apartments really, like, fall into place. And it's this art right here, bro. Let me turn this light on. Bro, this art is beautiful, bro. Shout out to my boy, Vane. Bro, he went crazy. If y'all don't know who that is, I'm pretty sure most of y'all know who exactly who he is, because my boy going crazy right now. But all this art is from him, man. And I actually got it for the free, like, which is crazy. Like, I really, like, if you watching this, bro, I really like, appreciate you, bro. Like, real talk, I'm, bro, I would, I need to cop some more art, bro. I need to cop, like, some art from over there. Like, I just need hella art from you, because, like, I just really appreciate this, bro. And it was, like, literally my first gift from when I moved in. Like, this was, like, my first piece of, like, furniture, art, or whatever. Decoration, that's really what I meant. So, got a whole bunch of art, man. We got Kobe, we got Fredo Santana, we got LeBron, record breaking shot. We got Kobe over there. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, this is beautiful, bro. Like, real time. And I'm pretty sure one of these is signed. Sign for the freak. Sign for the. That me on time. If you watching this, I appreciate you, bro. Keep doing your thing. You, you. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Hey! So, coming out over here, y'all, we got my cool little, like, what is this called? I guess it's like a side table. I don't know exactly what it's called, but I love it. You feel me? Um, they got a whole bunch of other books that I read, y'all. Right here, we got my um, fashion, not fashion, well, designing book, whatever you want to call it. It's like a whole bunch of stuff to learn how to design. It's, all, it's a fabric book. There we go. It's a fabric book, because I told y'all I'm a clothing brand owner, so got a whole bunch of fabric stuff. You know, that's not really like a book. That's more like a book. <laughs> you feel me? But over here, we got a couple books. These are really my favorite books, which is why over here, like I told y'all, Usually when I wake up, I spend a lot of time right here on that red seat. So I usually just pick up a book, just like install good things into my mind, install knowledge into my mind right when I wake up. Cause that's like the best time to actually put anything into your mind for if you know that before you go to sleep and right, right when you wake up. So we got the way of a superior man right here. You know what I'm saying? For my young men who are kind of get, really I feel like if you're like 16 years, 16 years old and older, get this book and start reading it, bro. It teaches you about your work ethic about women. You know what I'm saying? A lot of men don't know about women. It teaches you about women, sexual desires, all that other stuff, you feel me? If you want to learn, just how to be like a really, I feel like a put together man, quote unquote. Nobody's perfect, but I feel like this book speaks about that. We got this cool lamp right here. And the cool thing about this is, watch this. Watch this, watch this, look. Bang, bang, pop. That shit turns on right when you tap it, bro. Like, all you gotta do is tap it, look. And it turns on. Oh, I think you can put something on it, right? Oh, damn, it's like fingerprint? It's fingerprint, twin! I never knew that. Say you swear. Oh, that's hard. It's fingerprint, bro. But yeah, cool little table, man. Uh, I mean, cool little lamp. It turns on by, well, when you tap it or whatever. Now, shout out to my boy, man. Y'all meet my boy Indigo. Now this is Indigo, but this is my other plant. I got this after I got my other one. This one is called, uh... I forgot the real name, cause they have their own special names. So the names don't matter right now. Now I ain't gonna lie me extra, but I did this earlier today. So you really don't need water right now. I'm just being extra, I ain't gonna lie. But yeah, got this cool little Indigo plant. Or oh, it's called Indigo, that's his name. Um, yeah. This plant is really just good for like toxins and air and better fresh air, so that's why I got it, yeah. Now, another cool thing that I have over here before we get into the next is this cool little rug right here, man. This is like my first rug that I ever got for real. So I'll probably forever keep it. And if, like I said, if y'all watch anime, then y'all know if you don't, then you don't know, but I watch anime. So I follow this, uh, this, this, 
uh, damn, this rug a lot. You feel me? I love it. It's under this table, and like I said, this is my books and my boy Indigo back here. You know what I'm saying? My boy Jay, Jay got fresh and up or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Not my dog, not my dog. Look at the cool little city view. I'm gonna show y'all at the end. Boom, coming on over here right next to the seat on Dick's session right here, man. We got like this cool little like, I don't know, this is really where I began. Ready, y'all? We got this cool big old mirror right here. I will be looking at myself. We got my boy right here, man. Let me show y'all. Um, I don't know what that nigga name is, but he just cool as hell. He is cool as hell, bro. Like, that nigga just cool as fuck. But we got this cool little rug right here, man. You know what I'm saying? I got this. A lot of people gonna think this is ugly, but I really only got this rug because I feel like it's cool to just stand and take a picture and show your fits of the day. Like, on some, like, cool, like, aesthetic, bro. It's like, you come over here, you feel me? You grab your phone, you fit, fit, flick. Damn, my screen dirty as fuck. God damn. But y'all get the point, but you just like, okay, this the fit of the day. Boom, you take a picture. And it's just some cool aesthetic shit, bro. So yeah, that's there. But I ain't show y'all this right here, man. This is like something that I just stand by. Like, just one of the things I forever stand by. I really do believe um, that is really me versus me. And when I say I believe it's me versus me, I mean like in a deeper way. I really mean like in a general sense of way. I truly believe everything is what you make it, but yeah, I live by that. That's there every single day. But yeah, y'all seen this section right here, man. Like I said, I got a whole bunch of shoes that y'all gonna see. And moving on to where the magic don't happen at all, bro. Literally, bro, this is my bedroom and I do nothing but sleep over here. This is not a king size. I think it's a queen size bed. I believe so. Come on, vein all over the wall, bro. Like, look at this. Y'all look at this beautiful art, son. Where we got a Michael Jordan, you know what I'm saying? Dream team right there, you feel me? We got MJ up there, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you feel me? We got my boy Charles Barkley. Is that Charles Barkley? That is Charles Barkley. That's Charles Barkley right there. We got another, basically the same thing as the other one. We got the Kobe right there, you know what I'm saying? We got a couple of wrestling pieces, you feel me? Over here, we got like some more wrestling pieces. If y'all don't know, Tyler Creator is like my favorite artist. More Eminem, we got DBS up there. If y'all don't know what DBS is, Dragon Ball Super, we got that up here. And then we got another Dream Team poster right here. Sit down here, man, like I told y'all, I have a whole bunch of shoes. I'm not gonna do a shoe collection, so I'm just gonna kinda show y'all just all the shoes I have. If y'all know what they are, then y'all know what they are. Got some over there, and I got some on this cool little shelf right here, as y'all can see. So boom, man, over here, man, I know the lighting is a little yellow, but just bear with me. We got a big ass TV right here. Um, damn, that's it. Oh, oh, it's not. Oh yeah, yeah, a lot of y'all niggas probably love this section right here, but this is my gaming. Bro, why the fuck am I lying, bro? I don't play video games, y'all, but this is supposed to be my gaming section, my gaming area. Let me turn the light off. I think it looks better when the lights on. So boom, y'all probably can't see me since the lights is off. But this is actually, yeah, you know, like I said, it's supposed to be like my little PC area, man. I got my little PC headphones, whatever you want to call them. I know the lighting isn't the best, but just bear with me. Um, yeah, I got that. Got this cool little clock, clock right here. It's currently 2.39 a.m. of the day y'all are watching this, which is December 1st. So, got this cool little clock right here, man. And then I got a PC, two-screen PC that I don't use. The only thing I do on here is play Forza. And it's because I have a whole bunch of dream cards that I just play on here. If any of y'all could actually recommend me like anything to cover like my wire, like my, I said my wire, is it wires? Is it wires? My cords, any of y'all could like put me down to anything to like help with my cords and stuff like that. Let me know in the comments down below cause I need something cause my cords and all that is horrible down here. But cool little stuff right there, man. Also another cool thing about this place is the view bro like the view let me turn the lights off so as y'all can see man y'all can hear me y'all probably can see me a little bit on the little thing right there but this is the view man coming from the little gaming uh area right there you know what i'm saying we got the computers down here i don't know if y'all can see it's kind of glitchy or whatever but i'm gonna try not to move the camera but yeah that's the beautiful view you see bro from the little gaming area man i love this view sometimes i look at it when i do sit over here which is almost never oh oh <laughs> Hell yeah, on to the next man. We got this cool little area right here, man. So I got this rug right here on the floor that says, what a good day. Now this rug, I don't know what it is. When I usually wake up, like I sleep right here. When I wake up, the first thing I do is walk to that restroom. I don't know, I always look down and I just look at what a good day. And it always reminds me to just affirm that to my head. So I just like, what a good day. Like, 
it's gonna be a good day. Like I just give myself a whole bunch of positive thoughts, like I said before I go sit over there as well. So I always see this and says, what a good day. And right next to it, bro, we gonna see a big ass dollar bill. Cause at this stage of my life, I'm at the stage of my life of building, building generational wealth. You know what I'm saying? Just getting it for myself, doing as much as I can. So cool of motivation and positive thought to myself. You feel me? So boom. Walking over here, man, we got the closet. Now, I'm not gonna go in here because I'm gonna give you a full video on the closet tour when I actually. Get it cleaned up, cause that mother crazy. I ain't gonna lie, like I'm a very clean person. Like I ain't gonna lie, I be thinking I have OCD sometimes, cause I can't stay in places when it's too unorganized. But lately, I have been grinding. I have been on the rush left and right, and my closet is pretty crazy, bro. If y'all don't know, I also do fashion and a whole bunch of stuff like that. So, bro, your closet is kind of banned. It's 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 gonna be dirty, not dirty. It's gonna be unorganized, and also as well, it's uh, it's not a walk-in closet. It's pretty high. But I have a lot of clothes, so it could be pretty messy and it's pretty hard to keep organized. I need a walk-in closet. Probably, I'm probably my move real soon, so yeah. But you know, over here we got this cool little mirror right here, man, where I be seeing myself, you know what I'm saying? When I get ready sometimes, I just look at myself right here and I just be like. Slide door mirror. So yeah, we got this cool little connected dryer washer. I'm not gonna lie, this dryer washer is like, it's cool, they get the job done. I ain't gonna lie, they get the job done. Uh, this is the actual washer right here. And this is the dryer right here, they get the job done. It just be loud as hell, but what the fuck do you expect? So boom, coming into the restroom, man, we got me. You know what I'm saying? We got me, man, we got a big hand mirror. You know what I'm saying? I said the big mirror, like every restroom don't have a mirror, but we got this huge mirror. And now this restroom ain't nothing too cool about it, bro. I still got a whole lot of stuff to do in here. I still gotta put a whole bunch of other LED lights. I only got LED lights around, as y'all can see. Well, can y'all see for, can y'all see? Y'all can see, I got it around the, uh, what's it called? Yeah, uh, let's really get about the restroom, bro. Ain't nothing here, bro. I don't even know why we came in the restroom, bro. Hey, ain't nothing here, bro. Ain't nothing here. You know what I'm saying? Over here, we got the cool little shower, or whatever. We got the toilet right there. Let's go on to the next. After you leave the restroom on the other side, man, you basically make it back to the kitchen. As y'all can see, we're back in the kitchen. We got the kitchen right here, and we are where y'all haven't seen yet, which I'm gonna show y'all all the boxes. Ignore that. But this section right here that y'all haven't seen. So, we got like this cool little hallway or whatever you wanna call it. I don't know what it is. So this right here, clothing rack, is all my clothing rack pieces. Um, plug. Like I said, if y'all actually wanna go, cop it, baby. Boom, we got the beautiful blue, man. If y'all want this pink, got the blue. Oh, you say you don't want that one? It's cool, bro. I got you with the brown. Oh, you don't want the brown? I got you with the black, bro. Oh, acid wash, by the way. Oh, you don't want the black. Hey. Damn, you don't like it. It's cool, bro. Ouch. You feel me? Oh, you don't like any of that too? It's cool, bro. You thought I was done. I know you did. I know you did. But guess what? Dior ain't never done it. You know what I'm saying? We ain't never done it at BRS. So we got green as well. <laughs> you feel me? And also as well as I have a whole bunch of pants with them. I got the blue pants. Y'all kind of could just take a guess at what it looked like. So yeah, um, I'm not gonna show y'all all that, but yeah, I got this cool little rack right here where I keep my clothing rack pieces. I just like looking at them because without this, I wouldn't have this. So yeah, uh, over here, got my backpack, backpacks. Uh, I got this cool rack cement bag. This was a real item. I'm the type of person when I get some, so trust me, I'm a motherfucking wear that shit. I'm not gonna be angry. I ain't gonna be one of them bougie ass niggas, bro. I'm gonna wear my shit. You feel me? And then I got this cool little big bag that's called Baby Milo. I keep saying baby, baby, baby Milo bag. What's in here? I sure haven't been wearing this as well. So what's in here? Oh, ain't nothing here. Shit felt filled, filled up. Oh, you see that? Two shots. One shot. You know what I'm saying? Imagine it's tie game. You know what I'm saying? I just no. We was down by we was down by one. I just tied the game. So now if I hit this. It's game GG, you know what I'm saying? We, we go home, one second on the clock, come on now. It's on, it's on Dior, for the DRS. For the game! Bro, I swear, no, no, I swear the rim's broke, bro. So if you come in here, you know what I'm saying? We got all this camera stuff right here, bro. This is like the little, like, I don't know. I feel like everybody got that one 
pant or one cabinet where there's just a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, but this section right here is all my camera stuff, man. We got a gimbal. We got my Canon G7 uh, X Mark II that barely works anymore. This is my first camera. If y'all go, oh, well, y'all gotta go to my main YouTube channel. But bro, when I tell y'all that camera was like destroyed, but I still made it work. And that's what they, any of y'all who wanna start a, clothing, a YouTube channel, anything like that, bro, quit trying to get the best camera. Quit trying to do all that, bro. If you got an iPhone, that's all that matters, bro. When I tell y'all, this camera is destroyed. Look at this. It has a it has a rubber band holding the screen. Bro, this tape in the back. So, hey, I started somewhere. So, any of y'all who want to do the same thing, bro, you have to start somewhere, bro. Quit trying to be this goddamn perfectionist that you're not. Not, not even that you're not, that you don't have to be. You know what I'm saying? I got this camera for $230. And if y'all know how much these cost, these cost... At the time last year, like three forty, so hundred dollar deal because I didn't want to pay that shit, and I paid what the hell I got. You know what I'm saying? I got a whole bunch of scrapes and stuff like that. But I made this junk work. I work. I use this every single day, bro. and I'm just grateful. I think it still works. That shit still fucking works. What the hell, bro? Hold on, bro. It still works. Oh my gosh. It's kind of broke everywhere. So many memories, bro. So many freaking memories. And why the quality look decent though? Anyways, I just got lost in the songs. But yeah, like I was saying, got a whole bunch of camera stuff, gimbal, camera battery, tripods, cool little speaker, uh, more camera stuff, like, I got a stock lens back here, microphone. Yeah, it's just a whole bunch of camera stuff in here. Let me see as y'all can see. We got like microphone, lens. we got gimbal box, yeah. All this is like a whole bunch of camera stuff. So yeah, not much to say about it. Coming down here, y'all. So all these clothes, if y'all don't know, go follow me on Instagram. I make, a, I make a whole bunch of reels on Instagram and these are like all the fits I have prepared for my fits. That I'm gonna throw on, so um, yeah, it's just a couple of pieces that I just leave over here so I know exactly. Because I told y'all my closet is crazy and I don't want to go through it all the time, so I just kind of like prep my fits so that I know exactly what to do. So, yeah, over here we got a diffuser, I think that's what it's called. Um, currently, I have like some lavender type scent in here, and I love this, it just makes the whole crib smell beautiful. But if you walk in here, it smells amazing. Candles are tough, but these. I ain't gonna lie, they get the job, the job done quick. Like, I just seen that. Uh, camera, batteries, and we got this full plant right here. You know what I'm saying? This is the only full plant I have, so, yeah. Damn, so that's crazy, y'all. That is really it for the apartment tour, bro. Like, that's actually it. Oh, I ain't show y'all the outside, right? I wanna see the outside? I'll show y'all the outside. I'll show, I'll show y'all the view, you know what I'm saying? I'll show y'all the view of what I see usually at night. I'll be extremely cold, y'all. If I live in Atlanta and right now, and it's like the weather be acting weird, bro. As y'all can see, man, hopefully y'all can see me. Y'all should be able to see me. Let me turn the light on. Y'all should be able to see me, man. This is the balcony, bro. Actually, see, you know what I'm saying? It's super cool view. It's like the best view I probably could ever ask for. I don't know if y'all can hear, there's people downstairs or at the bottom like arguing, like typical Atlanta stuff, like it ain't nothing. Mm -hmm. Bunch of group of people. I ain't gonna show y'all because I don't want y'all to know the street I live on. Niggas, shut up. Oh shit, these niggas hear me. What the fuck? <laughs> also on the balcony, y'all, I got these two chairs that I barely ever sit on anymore because it's too cold for that. But during the summer, I was kind of sitting over here just meditating usually. In the rise, I'll sit over here, meditate and all that. But it got cold, so <laughs> yeah, I'm, yeah, let's just go ahead and close that motherfucker. But yeah, that's going to be it for this cool little apartment tour, man. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. This is my apartment tour, this is where I be chilling, this is where I be, you know what I'm saying, putting my head at night, putting my head at night, laying my head at night, um, working, all that, bro. I'm not gonna lie, I'm probably finna be moving into a bigger apartment, like in a couple months, honestly, because I need more space or whatever, and this place is a little bit too cluttered. Y'all let me know in the comments down below what y'all think of the apartment. Also, help me out. This wall right here, it needs some love. As y'all can see, bro, this is like the only wall with no decoration. And actually, just because I feel like, is it boring to just add more art? Y'all like, like, let me know. Is it boring to just add more like art 
right here? Or should I just get something crazy? Like, I've been looking for something. It's a big ass wall, so I need something like huge. What I really was going to do, but I don't think it's going to happen because by then I'll probably be been moved out, was I wanted to put my YouTube plaques when I get them. I have two channels right now, but I have three. But I have two channels I'm really working on. I'm gonna put my main channel and my vlog channel, which is what y'all are working, y'all watch it, because we finna get to 100K. But by the time I get my plaques, we would've been moved. That's what I need mean to say. But yeah, yeah, y'all let me know in the comments down below. Any of y'all, especially the females, y'all be good at decorating, bro. On my dudes who ain't know how to decorate for real, let me know what I can put over here, because I don't want some big blank wall. Literally nothing. I don't know, I feel like playing more art would be lame, but y'all tell me. I really do appreciate you for coming over. I love company, but <laughs> you have got to go, bro. It was so much love having you over here and, you know, seeing the place and whatever. It's not fully furnished. I still got a lot of stuff to do. Um, but if y'all also got any ideas where y'all like, ooh, you should put that over there, jump in the comments down below. Um, yap, yap, yap. You gotta go, bro. Bro, get out, bro. Like, what you doing? Nigga, just sit over here and stare at me, bro. Like, nigga, cheese. Fuck you want? You want a picture? You want a picture? You want a picture? I got you, bro. You, you need. Okay, I got you. All right, get out, bro. That's another. That's three bigs, bro. Bro, you need help? <sighs> Go and ask me. On display, bro. Door right here. I got you. I'm gonna open it for you. Got you, bro. We're not gonna do this again, bro. Get out, bro. Since I gotta grab your ass like this. Since you're playing too much, I'm gonna just grab you like these by your goddamn neck. Pause. All right, bro. I appreciate you for coming, all right? The elevator's down there. And the stairs is that way. But I don't know if you want to take the stairs, but I think you should take that way. Right there, take the right. Click the button. I'll see you later, bro. Bro, go, bruh. Go. You just go. All right, bro. Stay there, then. I'll see you tomorrow. There you go.